Hey, what is up, you guys, and welcome back to The 423. The saga continues in the breakup between Joe Budden and Sin Santana after someone on Lipstick Alley uncovered footage of Joe with another woman from back in March when their relationship was supposedly still going strong. In a vlog by a YouTuber named Jordan Christina, her and her friends are in Miami and in a super short segment in the middle of the video, there's some footage of Joe Budden walking the Miami streets with another woman who turns out to be former Taz Angel, Jazz McKendrick. Brush on y'all? All right. If you're not familiar with Jasma, she's a well-known model turned realtor in the Miami scene. She previously made headlines for being in a relationship with Italian soccer player Christian Vieri, which was said to overlap with his relationship with Naomi Campbell. And Jasma's marriage to him ended back in 2017 after her soccer player Boo was called out for being a racist. Now, the reason this is making people talk so much, besides just the possibility of Joe cheating, is because of Sin Santana's comments about black women that resurfaced a few months back. If you're not familiar with the story, back in 2016 on Angela Yee's podcast, Sin discussed her love of black men and, in the process, ended up saying some pretty disrespectful things about black women. Uh, Y'all can yeah. keep the Puerto Rican men. I'm good. Oh, yeah, I'm oh, good on a Puerto Rican men, too. So like, what does that right mean, now? Sin? I do black guys all day. So oh, shit. I did the Spanish, Stephanie too. I did yeah, the Spanish I thing. Does it work guys. out for me? I'm good. Why? Mm. What's wrong with guys that are Hispanic? I don't know. I think they're too emotional. You don't think I black they're very are overly possessive? Me, they huh? are the Puerto Ricans. Oh my god, oh my are you god. breathing so hard? Nah, what? I don't have time for that. <laughs> <laughs> why are you so breathing? I got time for them fucking Puerto Ricans. <laughs> like, why he got black so guys close can to be possessive that picture, too? Like, yeah, but they they're controlling. They no, Hispanic men are very possessive, though. Ridiculous. Hispanic yeah. men are way more possessive, and yeah. black guys cater to to us Spanish girls, especially like they. You know what? Let me not even get into uh -oh, that. She's going to get herself in trouble now. <laughs> the black girls, yeah. They're gonna be nah, like, I, I didn't mean it like that, but, you know, black girls going to take it personal. They'll be like, uh-uh. <laughs> nah, but um, I'm good. I, I don't, like I'm done with the pop. So when that audio resurfaced a few months back, people were on Sin and Joe's ass. And since then, people have been saying Sin is canceled, blah, blah, blah. But now, Joe was seen not only walking around with another girl, but with a black woman, and people are laughing in Sin's face over this, saying her comment about men catering to Spanish women has come back to bite her in the ass. This whole situation is especially interesting because from listening to what Joe said when he talked about the breakup, it really doesn't sound like cheating was the reason, and even if it was, it sure wasn't him possibly cheating with Jasma because this was all the way back in March, and things were still going just fine after that. Joe actually did respond to the reports about his philandering in yet another subtweet where he wrote LOL slow news day. And I'm not gonna lie, it is a pretty slow news day, but that doesn't change the fact that this situation is looking more and more like Joe actually did something rather than what a lot of people were assuming before, which was just Sin getting bored after not getting enough attention from her man. Following that a little while later, he came back to Twitter and actually talked a little bit about the breakup and this time, he called it a breakup instead of pretending like it wasn't. He tweeted, nice day out, that's all I got, to which someone responded saying that he must be miserable, and he replied, lol nah, you missed those years, this doesn't quite compare. Then he went on to say, when you can really enjoy a meal during your breakup diet. So now it looks like he's really leaning into this whole thing, and we will definitely be hearing more about this on the next podcast. But of course, I want to know what you guys think. Do you think that Joe really cheated on Sin back in March? And do you think it stings more for her to see him going for a black woman when Sin was so sure he catered to her as a Latina? Leave your thoughts down below in the comments, subscribe to the 423 for more videos, and if you like this one, just give it a quick thumbs up. That is it for today. I will see you guys next time. Bye.